Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. Uh, guess what we're going to talk about today? You guessed it, Zoom. So let's talk about when you're in a Zoom meeting and you've got split screen and you're listening to whoever's talking and you're taking notes and you have got it in gallery mode and you see a bunch of people and then bam, somebody decides to share their screen and now all of a sudden your whole screen just becomes Zoom and now you've lost your place on what you were typing, you've maybe lost your notes that you were reading, whatever happens to be going on. So let's talk about how to solve that. So we can go into the Zoom application on our computer. This should work on a Mac or a Windows computer. And you open the application, you hit the little gear wheel and you go into settings. There's this lovely button over settings pop up. There's this lovely share uh, screen button, fourth one down on the left. When you click on that button, you are presented with options. So window size, when screen sharing, by default, it goes to full screen. So we can say, let's maintain current size. So now your window size of your Zoom should not automatically adjust in size when someone does a screen share. Now you can also go in and check and uncheck settings like scale to fit the shared content to your Zoom window, uh, do side by side mode. I would leave those the way they are. So what that means, the first one means if you've got split screen, um, it's going to make the shared screen as large as it can within that window at the same size you had open. It's gonna fit it as much as it can to that size. Side by side means it's gonna show the participants on the side of that image while someone is sharing the screen, but still within the same size zoom window that you had it in before they started sharing the screen. Now you can silence system notifications when you're sharing your screen. That's one of your benefits. So if you're sharing the screen, then uh, you're not gonna hear any of your own notifications go off. Uh, gives you options to share individual windows or share all windows from an application. Automatically share a desktop or pick what you wanna share. And then uh, when you share directly in a Zoom room, they can either automatically share the desktop or show all sharing options. For the most part, I would leave those three sections alone, leave them the way they are. I would change your full screen mode to maintain current size. And then maybe the only other one that you'd wanna mess with is maybe you don't want side by side on and you want maybe the people across the top of your zoom window as opposed to the side. Uh, but once you click that, you don't need to do anything else. You can close out of these settings and then when you're in a Zoom meeting and it goes, someone shares their screen or you share your screen, it will not automatically adjust the size of your Zoom window. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope this is helpful for all of you out there that have been plagued by losing your place or having to stop taking your notes because the Zoom window all of a sudden resizes itself to your full screen. So uh, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, and I will continue to provide valuable content for you all. Thank you very much.